Hello everyone, I'm gonna present you my uh, new little mod outfit changer. It exists from uh, since a long time, but uh, I'm re releasing it to the public today, so that's why I make a video on how to use it and to showcase you the usage. So, you have this little mod, you put it on plugin from uh, BPNX, and uh, you just start your game. A new folder gonna be created. Here, outfit changer, and you can open it to see what is happening. But this is just file for the for the mod to work. Okay, so you have uh, no really interest looking at this. You can, I will explain you later how to read it. Okay, so I just started another hackon so we can see what is happening in the game. So I'm gonna just start a little server and. Uh, Wait for Manushin to join, like this. So at the moment, I have nothing on me. Okay. Perfect. So to open the mod, you have to press F1, like this. And you're gonna see this little menu. To start the mod, you just have to press right click on um, outfit changer. And you will have this uh, all this um, possibility. Okay. If you want to close this, you press again F1, like this. Okay. So you see a lot of options. Uh, the first thing you, we can look together in is the scan item option. This lets you scan the item you want in the um, random outfit loop and a random outfit ounce. So you start by right clicking on a scan item. Uh, so you, for navigation, you have to use the scroll wheel. And then you click on uh, scan item false, you right click on it. It's gonna turn to true, you have a little message in the chat. And you see at the moment I got nothing on me. And I'm gonna just wear everything I want in the random, random loop. So for example, like this. You see in the chat it's gonna say I registered something. Okay, I'm gonna just select a, select a random item. Like this, maybe this more hot, like this, uh, maybe, oops, maybe this, this one as well, okay, and some shows like this. Okay, when you're done with the scanning, you can just escape escape the, um, the inventory and you press again on the scan item and you put it on false, like this. So now, if you check on the um, on the file, you have the item.txt, it's gonna store all the ID of the item you scanned and the type of item, like if it's a hair, hat, face, shoe, etc. Okay, so you just close this. And you can, for example, use the random outfit loop. It's gonna loop through all your item, like this. If I check on the man option, you see. So this option takes a lot of uh, frame, per, frame per second. So if you don't, if you don't have a, li a big computer, you can't really uh, use it in game. So this is just for a little flex, like at the end of a game, something like that. But you can use. Uh, the alternative, the random outfit ons, it's gonna change your outfit ons. Oh, so if we start a game like this, it works also in game. I'll show you with the loop option. I'm gonna activate it, and you see, uh, oops, not the good account. Yep, it's gonna loop in game as well. This is not. Uh, because I got more, this works for everyone. So everyone can see your item. Like this. Okay. So I'm gonna just kill this little guy. And now we're gonna look at the um, at another feature like. Reset registered item. If you click on this, 
gonna just erase all the file for the random item, okay? So that's it. And you can uh, again uh, scan more item. So let's see now the outfit option. This is the best option, I guess. So if you want to save uh, an outfit, you go in inventory, you select an outfit, for example, this one. I'm gonna wear some stuff, maybe like this, some face and shoes. So I'm gonna check with Manuchian how it looks like. Okay, so this is pretty decent. So you have just to click or right click on the save current outfit. And I'm gonna ask in the chat to give a name to the outfit. So I will, exp for example, put uh, default Gibson. And you see it gonna register that I put the um, default Gibson. And when I go on um, select outfit, now I have the option to select default Gibson. So for example, if I go in my inventory, I put anything else like this this okay so this is not the same outfit okay I'm gonna just click on select out so okay if you want to change the outfit you I will have to re recover uh, another outfit so I'm gonna just save this one like this and you see I can select on selected outfit I can right click on it and use the scroll wheel to change so I have the default Gibson and the test if I want to wear the default Gibson, I put G default Gibson and I go on Equip Outfit. And then you're gonna put my uh, outfit, I already started. And in if I want to use the test outfit, I do the same. And gonna change my outfit. So this works in game as well. If you want to remove an outfit you don't like it, you just click on Delete Outfit. And that's it. Okay? So nothing is registered to this ID. I'm gonna put an over outfit let's just to let you see how it looks like. Uh, you cannot use the backpack on the outfit, it don't work. Because uh, we need some anchor to make the mod work. So that's it. I won't enter in the, de in the detail, but you can't use the backpack in the loop or anything else. For example, I, I will put this outfit and I'm gonna save it. Uh, old Gibson. Okay, so for example, if I put Gip default Gibson again, I'm gonna put back my outfit, and if I go on uh, old Gibson, I'm gonna put the other outfit like this. Okay. So what it looks like in the file? You go on a save the outfit, and you will see you have some ID, the name, and the item you have in your outfit. You don't have to have uh, like uh, shoes or a face. You can do a little outfit like, uh, for example, I want this outfit, and put this, and this, and okay, like this. I just have a little uh, party hat. I can do that as well. So I do save current outfit and I will put a noob outfit for example so if I update my file you're gonna see no I have the noob outfit that's like that so that's it guys for this mod uh, of course you can uh, delete the outfit and keep it so that's it okay bye bye guys